Wednesday. Can you believe it? I'm going for a spin. The Mumbles man is on his way over here. And he's got the guru with him. Mumbles man found a nice 14K yesterday at the Landonata. And I finally got most of my junk out of the way. So I'm freed up today. We'll see how it goes. Stand by. You know it wouldn't be complete if I didn't show you some knives. I picked them up yesterday. And you probably don't remember it, but I did these knives for a lady last year. And I thought she had her name. This is a big old Victor Knox. There's her name right there. She got it inscribed on the blades. I just don't see it on this blade. Oh, there it is right there. Right on the handle. And these other ones don't have it, but this one has it. But she don't want to back till next Wednesday, so I got plenty of time. She's going on a, I think she works on a ship. Cooks on a ship or something. At least that's what she said she was going to do. Maybe in Alaska. She moves around a lot. Stand by. The guru and the mumble man are very close. Guru. Huh? Mumbles man. I think that pipe is running now. Yeah, it's pumping now. You can see it. Land and Anna. Beautiful day. Off we go. Twelve oh seven. One scoop deep. No diamond ring, a gold ring. Stand by. My buddy Keith would like this. A fine piece of zipper. Well, I went north to the pier. I'm going north further. I've been, uh, what, six blocks, I guess. The Guru, the Mumbles man, they went south towards the pipe down by the Rudy Inlet. I've got uh, a couple of pennies, some aluminum, some brass. What else I got? I got a bottle cap. That's it, I think. No bling. Stand by, we're headed north. Well, I'm a couple of blocks north of the pier now. I've got a few quarters over here, some dimes. And I got my first piece of bling. Looks like a little silver medallion, or, you know, goes around your neck. I don't know if it's silver or not, but it, it looks like silver. But it could be pot metal, too. Got a nice little clasp on it. A loop or whatever that is you call it, that the chain goes through. Stand by. Well, right there is where the little pendant was. And right there, I got a 12, 43. Stand by, we'll see what that is. Everything's been one scoop deep, except for a couple pieces of copper.
I say it looks like 10 meter set. That's what it's supposed to be. Ten meter cent. And I just got through saying everything was shallow. Twelve scoops. Ten more meter cent. Yeah. I need a break. I'd be like Lawrence in Thailand. I have to take a break here. Good luck. Well, I'm headed back to the south now. I see the Mumbles man and the Guru have come on this side of the pier. I'm going to run up there and see how they make it out as I go back that way. Stand by. I got some more bling. Polar bear. No, elephant. With, with uh, sapphires. That's right. Must be platinum elephant, I think. Platinum elephant. That's right. Well, here comes the Mumbles man. See if I got him today or not. I might have the moles. Stand by. Well, are we going to have the mumbles yet? No. <laughs> not for me. The, the, the guru has a uh, gold looking pendant. Gold looking what? Pendant. Oh, yeah. I got two little pendants. I got a little teeny baby elephant and a little uh, silver like wing thing. Hangs on his chain, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah. But all on this side of the pier. I got, I got a pendant. I got some bigger cents too. Show me that yellow ticket. It ain't dead. I got a silver something similar, I think, maybe. The guru. It's a it's a Saint Saint Christopher's medal. That's something right there on the back of it. Very light. Protect us, it says. What? Protect us. What's that, Spanish? It says 14K, but I can't make it out for sure. You want to look at it with a loop? You want to get excited? Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's what it is. That'll be a chain around here with right I can see a one, it looks like a four and a KT. Yeah, you can see it good. 14K, but we just got dead in his loop out. You ought to get you a chain and put that around your neck. 14K St. Christopher. What is that one? I guess I'm the king of bling today. Iceberg. Small floating iceberg. That's probably worth saying the Titanic. Just drift it down this way. Yeah, that's it. Gotta be it. Drives a king of bling today. Bling. Guru. Guru got some fish gold. <laughs> You're a taquito digger, all right. Oh. He's on that one. Oh, you got a ring, huh? Or, oh, earring. Earring. It's an earring. I think it's silver. It sounds good. It sounds like gold. Oh, it's got a mark on his, on that shank of it, Dad, but I'll have to get his digger, his uh, magnifier to see what it is. Yeah. Well, there's a roundup, which we ain't had for a long time. Six dimes. I know I had a few dimes.
So you saw all the bling, I think. The little elephant. The last piece of bling. The iceberg. And the silver doodad. And the zipper. I should say half a zipper. I don't know what that is. Sounded good. Okay, I can't go tomorrow. I got a damn doctor's appointment, my six month checkup at 1 30. That's right when the tides low. But I'll be uh, available, I think, for Friday. Stand by. I'm going to hook up uh, Doc Beaver's stuff at the end. He, uh, he found two junkers yesterday and a, some kind of football thing this morning, but he was on the bay. Well, he's on the bay today. And his junkers came from uh, the Dada. And I put Denny's uh, gold ring at the first, the one he found yesterday, the 14K. So there's some yellow floating around. I like it. Stand by.